Hello, friends. Welcome to the F Society IRC podcast, a Mr. Robot review show. I'm your host, Hiroja Shai. Hello, friends. Welcome to the F Society IRC podcast, a Mr. Robot review show. I'm your host, Hiroja Shai. Hello. Uh, this is Hiroja Shai, your moderator of this channel, F Society IRC podcast. And this is my live reaction to episode 411, Exit. Uh, we have left the HTML codes and have gone to a completely different territory. So, <clears throat> what I need is for everyone to look at their bingo cards. And if you had alternative reality on there, I need you to come up to the front. I need to, you to collect your roses your prize money, your accolades, because that shit happened. <sighs> um, there has been a few what the fuck moments in television that I have witnessed. I would say the most similar, like the one that's really seared into my brain is and I'm giving my age away here <clears throat> the best of both worlds part one from Star Trek Next Generation in which Luke Cutis of Borg you know Picard if you're familiar with Star Trek you know John Luke is coming back um, Star Trek Picard I'm actually gonna be reviewing that show with some people I might you know towards the end of all this say where I'm going but and uh, Commander Riker, now the captain of the the Enterprise, not to go too much into it if you haven't seen it, it's on Netflix and Amazon Prime. There's ways to see the show. Uh, basically says fire to the Borg to destroy the, uh, the cutest who's John Luke who's been kidnapped and transformed and the Borg who's trying to invade and, and kill everybody. And uh, that was the end of the, the episode. Like he didn't know if the torpedoes when they hit was gonna kill the more cube or not you had to wait all summer long for that conclusion uh, so it was very shocking very surprising um, let's see <clears throat> I guess Scully getting kidnapped by the aliens off the mountain was a kind of a what the fuck moment from the X-Files <sighs> I'm sure there was some cartoon stuff that I'm just just forgetting. Uh, oh, oh yeah, Cowboy Bebop, Spike dying. I guess Francine being a double and getting into the you know being being made into a double and then Sydney fight fighting out that fight. Really, the Francine becoming a double was a. From the show Alias, <sighs> Lost. I guess the well, there was a lot of moments of Lost, but like the flash forward where they Jack's yelling, they have to go back. Uh, the others showing up, taking Walt. I mean, they you know that show. Whew, that show had some moments. Um, and there's been a lot of other television moments, but. I mean, they really went there. They really went. Activate the machine. Uh, alternate reality. Uh, again. Collect your flowers. Alternate reality people. Time travel people. Who, who got that? Who, who truly believed when everyone was naysaying, saying that this show was too grounded, that it would be like a jump the shark moment. Ugh. Uh, if they went there, collect them. You, you, you've earned it. You have earned it. You, you've been faithfully, since the hint of the potential since season two, all these years, like the last three years, almost four, you've been there. You collect your reward stars and names and persons, peoples. 
You've earned it. Um, mm. Our boo Tyra Wellick is back and in the hoodie and maybe knowledgeable of things. Not quite sure, but definitely looking like a C Silicon Valley startup kind of guy instead of um, American Psycho Bateman Wall Street Wolf of Wall Street kind of fellow. Very different. Shout out to uh, Minister Zhang, uh, living her best life as being the great philanthropist to the world. Um, clearly having all her things. Um, hey, Angela's back and she's alive. And they're about to get married, her and Elliot. Really messed up that they erased Darlene. Don't understand that. Not happy about that. She better be somehow in the, in the next two episodes. Not really feeling it. Not at all. Yes, she was in the beginning. Had a little bit more about them parting ways from Elliot's perspective. But nah. Mr. Robot was here. And the cancel of Elliot's. Still not sure why the third personality is important at all. That's ditto. She too will riot if Darlene is not in the next two episodes. No Leon, even though we've seen a preview that has not yet been on the uh, show yet. And there was no Gideon. I was a little perplexed by that but maybe Gideon somewhere else maybe he's in his own different world so yeah I my Rose Elliot met they had a very passionate conversation I'll get more in details in my full review the machine gets activated Elliot tries to stop the machine it doesn't work and we got, again, alternate reality people. Have your flowers. Have them all. Have all the prizes, okay? When you, when you go to the arcade game and they have that big, big bear or big animal, that's yours. You've earned it, okay? Was not expecting that. And I have very mixed feelings. I feel if the landing is not stick and don't get me wrong i was enjoying this alternate reality because i was mad confused but delighted because i'm a very sci-fi nerdy person and it, it spoke to me but i also felt like jumping the shark here and i, I just i if the landing is sticked then i'm fine if they stick the landing i'm cute if not then it it kind of went haywire which in it is own sometimes a beautiful mess, you know, with art and entertainment, it, it, it can still go. It can still go hard. Like My Chemical Romance. And all these fantastic songs, these pop songs that they put on the last episode. Which, by the way, as soon as I saw Darlene and her looking at Dom um, in that first part, that, that saxophone from the Carly Rae uh, Jensen song just popped into my head. You know, it's stuck there forever now. Um, but uh, I don't know how I feel about Elliot living that um, watching Marvel movies blah life <sighs> it's going to be a movie next episode, next episode and I am none of us are here prepared for it we are not prepared for it not even you with your prizes and your flowers alternative reality person okay you are not ready. I am so glad I didn't put out the, the episode I've been struggling the last two years to make, which was the Washington Township Ultimate MacGuffin. I was going to do a video essay, essay on it, and I'm glad I haven't done, I didn't do it because I would just, in the scope of things, look bad. But uh, maybe I'll just do a Mr. Robot Appreciation wrap-up uh, video essay. But <sighs> those are my thoughts. My initial reactions is... Uh, 
what what just happened I'm not quite liking this feeling but I'm not stopping what's going on here I uh, our, I'm having a migraine my brain hurts my brain hurts just like Alt Elliot Oh. Probably should have not gone with the tea, but gone with uh, something stronger. But this is Rosa Scheib. Uh, until next time, friends. I this is Society RC podcast and Mr. Robot Review Show. I'm logging off. Yeah, friends. Uh, until next time.